The name Countach from Lamborghini is actually a swear word that conveys astonishment, an awe in a striking, yet positive manner, reflecting the car's breathtaking impact. According to the CEO of Bugatti, the average Bugatti customer owns a staggering 80 for cars, a jet, and a yacht compared to an average Bentley owner who may possess about eight cars. This stark comparison highlights the wealth disparity between millionaires and billionaires. Moving on, with how the Volkswagen Beetle, originally designated as the Type 1, earned its nickname due to its distinctive design. It wasn't until 1967 that Beetle became its official name, following its popular adoption. Renault's high-performance 2-liter turbo engine carries the humorous name F for RT, playfully referred to as Fart. This quirky naming brings a touch of humor to the automotive industry. Due to the Porsche 959 lacking crash test verification, it was illegal to drive in the US. This was unfortunate for Bill Gates, who had purchased the vehicle and was subsequently required to wait 13 years for legislative adjustments. In the 1970s, Sweden dealt 1,000 Volvos to North Korea, yet Kim Jong's regime never settled the payment. Sweden persists in billing North Korea semi-annually for the cars. Before the war, the car brand known as Jaguar operated under the name SS. The company opted for a name change to avoid any connections with the notorious Nazi SS troops. Every bolt in the assembly is crafted from titanium and features a laser-etched Pagani emblem on it. There are 1,400 of them in total, and together they cost $112,000. Titanium is valued for its strength and lightness, yet it comes with a high price tag. Volvo set a precedent by installing six-figure odometers in its cars, a nod to their durability and reliability. There are only one 1983 Corvette ever exist. This is because Chevrolet postponed the launch of their C for model to the following year, but not before producing about 40 cars in 1983 for testing, with just one surviving to this day. To accurately track the rapid revving of its V10 engine, Lexus equipped the LFA with a digital rev counter, outpacing traditional analog versions. Chevy's engine lineup showcases an interesting details. Their largest small block V8 exceeds the size of their smallest big block V8. Volkswagen's top selling product is not a vehicle, but a sausage. It was called the VW Currywurst, initially made for the factory's cafeteria gained such popularity that it started being sold in supermarkets as well, complete with its own part number. The 1938 Buick Wide Job stood as the first concept car, designed to gauge public reaction to new stylistic approaches by Buick, and marked a significant milestone in automotive design history. The original asking price for the Bugatti Veyron was around $1 million. Surprisingly, this was quite the deal since the production cost for each Varan was $5 million. The Porsche 959, a quintessential 80 supercar, is uniquely equipped with a low-speed gear for tackling off-road terrains. High-profile gifts to the Pope included a Ferrari Mondial Cabriolet, Lamborghini Huracan, and the last Ferrari Enzo ever made, redefining luxury. Elon Musk, launched a Tesla Roadster into space. This stunt aimed to showcase the impressive payload capabilities of the SpaceX Falcon Heavy rocket, capturing the world's attention. Irving Gordon is the person who holds the record for the highest vehicle mileage recorded on his 1966 Volvo 180 OS, having traveled over 3 million miles. This distance is nearly equivalent to making 120 full rotations around the Earth. The introduction of electric windows in the Lotus Elise caused a stir among purists due to weight concerns. However, the new feature was surprisingly lighter. Theoretically, certain supercars produce enough downforce to cruise upside down in a tunnel, although no one has dared to test this. The Ford Model T, celebrated as the first widely affordable automobile, was initially sold for as low as $260, a figure astonishingly below for $1,000 in today's currency. Bob Marley chose to drive a BMW, aligning serendipitously with the initials of his reggae band, Bob Marley and the Whalers. The Bugatti Veyron's tires can only last 15 minutes at top speed. This eclipsed by its fuel tank draining in 12 minutes. 
New York's Museum of Modern Art displayed a unique exhibit featuring cartel lights, blending technology with art. Denmark is known for being one of the costliest places to purchase a new car, largely due to the government's imposition of up to 150% tax on new car sales. This hefty tax makes it unlikely to see high-end luxury cars like Bugatus on Danish roads. In 2004, Oprah gave free cars to every person in their audience, as a surprise $6,000 tax burden forced many to quickly sell the vehicles. Hong Kong has the highest number of Rolls Royces per capita globally. September 3, 1976, marked a significant shift in Sweden as the country transitioned to right-hand traffic. The sudden change led to widespread confusion, mitigated somewhat by a special song on the radio advising drivers to keep to the right. Audi, aiming to adapt to the demands of the Indian market, developed a specifically designed car horn. This modification catered to the need for a louder, and more durable horn able to withstand frequent use in heavy traffic. Carl Benz is often credited with inventing the first car, but his true achievement was patenting the first vehicle and creating several identical units. This led to the recognition of his vehicle as the first production car. During the initial days of automobiles, they were lauded as an eco-friendly alternative to horses. This view emerged as they replaced horses, which were infamous for littering streets with their waste. Ah, horse shit! In 1973, the U.S. instituted a nationwide speed limit of 55 miles per hour on highways. This measure aimed to conserve fuel during the oil crisis rather than to enhance road safety. Many admire the beauty of the Alfa Romeo GTV6, yet its creator, Giorgetto Giugiaro, begs to differ. Disturbed by modifications to his initial design, Giugiaro went as far as filing a lawsuit to prevent Alfa Romeo from associating his name with the vehicle. Japan shows strong preference for domestic cars, with only 6% of vehicle sales accounted for by foreign makes. In the UK, Mitsubishi Evo models feature an FQ badge followed by a horsepower number. The abbreviation FQ was explained to the curious Japanese executives as standing for fine quality. The inspiration behind cruise control, invented by Ralph Teeter in 1948, came from his frustration with his lawyer's inconsistent driving speed. Teeter, despite being blind, sought to create a solution that maintained a car's speed for comfort and efficiency. Interestingly, about 65% of countries worldwide have their traffic drive on the right side of the road. Despite what a map might suggest, populous countries like India, which drive on the left due to their British colonial past, don't shift this percentage significantly. Airbags deploy in a mere 0.03 seconds, far quicker than the average blink, providing instant protection. A modern car has a total of 30,000 different parts. How many can you name? Ford's Model T set a production milestone by assembling a car every 24 seconds by the end of its era. With an average of 24 defects, 1960s American cars paved the way for the rise of more reliable Japanese vehicles, leading to consumer dissatisfaction. With their high rate of recyclability, cars rank as the top recycled consumer product globally. Dubai boasts one of the world's fastest police vehicles like the Bugatti Veyron, capable of speeds up to 250 miles per hour. Lamborghini's gift to Italy, a V10 Gallardo police car, proved to swift for safety, meeting its demise in a crash after just a year in service. In Switzerland, a staggering speeding fine of $1 million was handed out to an individual driving a Mercedes SLS at a velocity of 180 miles per hour in a 70 miles per hour zone. As a result of the Swiss law, which bases fines on the offender's income, this penalty set a record for the largest speeding fine. Contrary to popular belief, the Porsche Taken is not Porsche's inaugural electric vehicle. That distinction goes to the 8098 Cita Phaeton, crafted by Ferdin and Porsche himself, marking the electric beginning of the iconic brand. The world of cinema saw the iconic character Bruce Wayne in Christopher Nolan's rendition of Batman, driving a Lamborghini Murcielago. Intriguingly, the name Murcielago translates to bat in Spanish, a fitting choice for the caped crusader. The Cambodian 500 Real Note features images of modern vehicles, specifically a Nissan Juke and a Toyota Camry, on its reverse side. 
This trend of incorporating cars into currency design isn't new for Cambodia, as a previous version of the note depicted another type of sports car that some suspect was a Porsche Cayman. The Ferrari 250 GTO has achieved an extraordinary status, being legally acknowledged as a work of art by the courts. This prestigious recognition also serves as a strategic move by Ferrari to prevent any attempts to produce replicas of what is considered one of the most valuable collector cars in the world. Up until 1973, car transmissions included whale oil as a component until the endangerment of whales prompted a ban. This led to a dramatic 800% increase in transmission failures until a suitable synthetic alternative was found years later. With a population of around 1.3 billion passenger cars globally, we find that there is approximately one car for every five individuals on Earth, San Marino. In particular, boasts an impressive statistic of 1.2 cars per resident, the highest car ownership per capita. A testament to their enduring quality and craftsmanship, it is estimated that 75% of all Rolls Royces ever produced are still in use today, while the remaining 25% were probably destroyed. The Toyota Previa SE, a first-gen marvel, boasts its supercar traits as a supercharged, mid-engine, all-wheel-drive minivan catering to seven passengers. Notably, many of the early parts used in Ford cars were manufactured by the Dodge Brothers Company, showcasing a curious interconnection in the automotive industry's history. In the realm of luxury vehicles, Koenigsegg pushed the envelope with the Travita, which features a diamond-dust-infused carbon fiber body. With only three units produced, each was sold at an unprecedented for $0.8 million, making it the most expensive road-legal car at the time. In a remarkable act of generosity over 50 years ago, Volvo invented the modern three-point seatbelt and made the patent openly available to all car manufacturers, reinforcing their reputation for prioritizing safety. While the United States currently boasts the largest number of vehicles globally, with 270 million cars, China is quickly gearing up to claim the top spot, marking a significant shift in automotive dominance. Only 18% of Americans can drive a manual transmission, and with only 5% of new cars in the US having a stick shift, this figure is poised to dwindle. Interestingly, opting for a stick shift might just make your car less attractive to thieves. Did you know that according to car insurance companies, an average driver is projected to be involved in three to four accidents within their lifetime? This statistic highlights the importance of safe driving practices and having insurance coverage. Did you know Norway is leading the way in the adoption of electric and hybrid vehicles, with these cars making up half of all new sales? However, in a commitment to environmental integrity, Norwegian law prohibits these vehicles from being advertised as green, recognizing that all cars, to some extent, negatively impact the planet. British traffic police keep teddy bears in their vehicles to comfort children involved in road accidents, demonstrating compassion in times of distress. This is something else. The Smart Roadster shares its wheelbase measurements with the Porsche 911 of the 997 generation, highlighting an interesting design parallel. The Autobahn in Germany offers a unique experience for drivers, being the only public road system worldwide where there's no official speed limit over certain sections allowing motorists to push their vehicles to the limit legally. Since a remarkable surge in stock prices in July 2020, Tesla has climbed the ranks to become the world's most valuable car manufacturer, successfully surpassing Toyota in the process. In the United States, women lead in new car purchases, accounting for 60 to percent of sales and highlighting a significant shift in market demographics. Biologists in Utah have discovered that vehicles pose a greater threat to deer populations than hunting, particularly on a 22-mile road stretch when an average of six deer are killed every single mile. Mr. Alan Swift from Springfield, Massachusetts drove his 1928 Rolls-Royce Roadster for 82 years until his death in 2005. After his passing, this cherished vehicle found its home in a museum. Lewis Chevrolet, the founder of the Chevrolet Car Company, faced a harsh twist of fate, dying impoverished and working as a mechanic at the very company he established. Leonardo da Vinci's foresight into automotive innovation was demonstrated by his sketch of a self-propelled carriage in 1478, centuries later. 
A replica of Da Vinci's design was constructed and is now preserved in the Museum of Science and History, showcasing his genius. Henry Ford's journey through the automotive industry, developing models A, B, C, F, K, and R, S, before achieving monumental success with the Model T. Etymologically speaking, the word car is derived from carom, a Latin term that initially referred to a two-wheeled Celtic or chariot. Over time, the term evolved to describe the motor vehicles we are familiar with today. Throughout the history of automobiles, the term dashboard dates back to the days of horse-drawn carriages. Originally, it was a wooden board placed at the front of the carriage to protect drivers from mud and debris kicked up by the horse's hooves. Daniel Craig enjoys a lifetime privilege unlike any other, courtesy of Aston Martin. As a reward for his on-screen loyalty, he's granted free access to any model straight from the factory. Roger Moore, captivated by the Lotus Esprit and for your eyes only, was slightly nudged to own it with a minor to percent discount. However, the allure wasn't enough to seal the deal. In the United States, the frequency of car theft is alarmingly high, with one vehicle being stolen every 45 seconds. Among these, the Honda Accord appears to be a particularly favored target among car thieves. A surprising reveal from BMW in 2010 showcased that 80% of BMW 1 Series owners mistakenly believed their cars were front-wheel drive, simply because most hatchbacks are. In response to the rampant carjackings in Johannesburg, South Africa, an inventive individual developed an anti-theft mechanism that emits flames from the sides of a car, selling a few hundred units of this dramatic device without facing bans. Each year, the world sees over 70 million new vehicles hit the road, with a significant share about a third originating from China's bustling production lines. On your final days, you'll realize you've spent nearly five months of your life idling at red lights, a thought to ponder as time ticks away. Surprisingly, cars are parked and unused for approximately 96% of their lifetime. With an average daily driving time of only an hour and 40 minutes, cars spend the vast majority of time stationary. The agility of vehicles is put to the test in the Moose Test, designed to simulate emergency lane changes. While supercars like Porsche 911 GT3 RS and McLaren 675 LT excel at 51 miles per hour, the 1999 Citroen Xantia astonishes by clocking 53 miles per hour, thanks to its hydro-pneumatic suspension which virtually eliminates body roll, allowing for impressive stability. The 1989 Honda Prelude broke new ground as the first mass-produced car featuring four-wheel steering, significantly enhancing vehicle maneuverability, yet this feature has not become standard in all cars. Remarkably, the contact area between an average family sedan's tires and the road is about the same as the space covered by placing the feet side by side. Based on Instagram hashtags, the Chevy Impala holds the title for the most hitted car model, a fact that resonates well with the incapriciating lowrider culture. America's traffic jams don't just fray nerves. They drain over $160 billion annually, accounting for vehicle wear, fuel wastage, and countless lost hours. Toyota Corolla's staggering sales numbers make it the world's favorite car, with a new owner every 40 seconds, amassing over 40 for million sales to date. Turning back to the early 20th century, the automotive landscape was considerably different, with electric cars comprising 38% of the market, steam cars at 40%, and gasoline-powered autos making up a mere 22%. A standard measure of power, one horsepower, is defined as lifting 550 pounds to a height of one foot in one second. Impressively, a galloping horse can generate up to 15 horsepower. The first car radio, a $200 luxury in 1920 to introduce by Chevrolet, almost faced bans due to fears of driver distraction of fortune in today's currency. Hyundai took a unique marketing approach with its Tucson model by offering a special The Walking Dead edition. Complete with a zombie survival kit, it boasts supplies for 72 hours, though it notably lacks a spiked bat for defense. Ford's Pinto was promoted through a radio advertisement with the tagline Pinto leaves you with that warm feeling. However, this tagline was quickly dropped after it came to light that the Pinto could easily catch fire upon being rear-ended. The Renault Aventine was ironically named, translating to ahead of time, yet its release was postponed due to engineering issues, contradicting its namesake. 
the Grand Tour show was nearly named Nigel because the show needed a name and Nigel is a name. The Moose Test is widely remembered for revealing the rollover risks in SUVs unexpectedly, however. Even a smaller class failed this test. As a result, Mercedes delayed the launch of their Smart for Point to model by a year and recalled the car to address this flaw. The Bentley Bentayga uses over 100 million lines of code in its computer system, raising questions about potential bugs. There's an interesting health statistic linked to transportation choices. Individuals who opt for public transport over driving their own cars typically weigh about 5 pounds less. The Shelby Cobra Super Snake stands as the most extraordinary and scarcest classic Cobra. Only two units were produced. One was kept by Shelby himself, while the other was purchased by Bill Cosby, who constantly manages to astound us. Los Angeles uniquely has more cars than people, highlighting its deep car culture and dependency. The standard pitch for most car horns in the USA is F. Just take a listen. And for our final list, 16% of car owners worldwide never wash their vehicles, 